Hi everyone, I'm Yang Yang. Welcome to Tea House, China Radio International's online video talk show. I'm happy to tell you that Tea House online video talk show is now one year old. Thank you for all your support. Without you, none of this would have been possible. I really appreciate. We hope Tea House will continue to provide you with a platform of communication for better world, and we hope you enjoy the ideas shared in Tea House. 四合院 or four side enclosed courtyard, is a shining part of Chinese culture. Today, we're having a cup of tea with Mr. Zhou Xinping, the founder of the Four Seasons Courtyard Hotel in Beijing. Hi, Mr. Zhou. Welcome to our program. First. Please introduce yourself to the audience. Hi Yang Yang, hi everybody.、Uh, my name is、uh, Zhou Xinping. I'm the founder of this、uh, uh, Si He Yuan Hotel called Four Seasons Courtyard Hotel, and、uh, I used to work、uh, in the media field for、uh, about ten years before I opened this uh, Courtyard uh, Hotel. I just made the poor tea for you. I heard that you're a big fan of Chinese tea. Yep. And the poor tea is your favorite, right? Yes. Why do you like this tea? I have a long history myself of drinking tea.、Uh, firstly, I like、uh, oolong tea because I'm from Fujian. Is、uh, oolong tea is from Fujian province. But gradually, I drink teas. I I drink、uh, different kinds of tea like oolong tea, green tea. Just to try this one. You used to work in foreign media industry for over ten years, and why did you start a hotel? Because I was tired of working in the media field. It was too challenging work for me, and I was getting older. I had traveled all around China already, so I, I thought it was a time for me、uh, to stop、uh, all this、uh, busy work and、uh, to do another, like more relaxing work. So that's why I start a hotel business. Then why did you start your hotel in this courtyard, or four side enclosed courtyard, not a modern building? I think first of all, I myself like to live in the courtyard because it's a very tradition Chinese residence house, and in the northern China, and、uh, it's closer to the nature the architecture, and.、Uh, I mean, compare with the apartment buildings. I used to live in the apartment building, and I had enough. And because of the crowds and the traffic, so Si He Yuan is a lot like laid back, you know, slow, very slow life in a slow hu tong. And、uh, I know that、uh, this hotel was founded about one year ago. How many guests have you welcomed?、Uh, we had、uh, quite good business, especially in the whole. Uh, spring and summer, autumn season. Yeah. So if we have thirty guests a month, then we could have about like three hundred guests already. I heard that most of your guests are from abroad.、Yes. So why do you think the foreign friend would like to come to your hotel, not some other modern ones? I think the people who chose to stay in a Si He Yuan hotel, they chose to be closer to Chinese culture, the tradition culture, you know, and tradition life.、Uh, Of Beijing, so、uh, that's why they chose Si He Yuan Hotel.、Mm. Okay, it's tea time. Please enjoy a nice cup of Chinese tea. Mr. Zhou, welcome to our program. Hi, Yang Yang. I heard that you love tea very much and have prepared several kinds of Chinese tea. I can't wait to see them. Please show us. The big families of Chinese teas. Actually, like we have like oolong tea, green tea, yellow tea, white tea, black tea, and red tea. So I can show you like oolong tea.、Uh, this is like Da Hong Bao from、uh, Wuyi Mountain. And it's the best oolong tea we can have now in China. And the red tea, this is red tea.、Uh, this is a red tea from Yunnan province, but there are many different other places produce red tea also.、Yeah. And、uh, for example, this. This is a very typical、uh, poor tea.、Yeah. 
how many years have um, this tea? Uh -huh. mm, this is not very old. It's like a, a what we call a shoe. Joe, thank you very much for joining our program. I hope you are happy and a prosperous new year. Thank you, Ben. You too. Okay, thank you for watching our program. Wherever you are, whatever you do, I hope 
you can welcome the coming Chinese New Year in a peaceful mind. Happy New Year!